everyone. Welcome back to another video. Today we're playing MM2N documenting the many Robloxians we come across in the summer update. Praying that we don't meet the red beans. They're quite the ferocious type. Also, how are you all doing? Make sure you're hydrated. Look at me hydrating myself in the ocean. I forgot to mention. This fish right here is a new friend I made. His name is Bait. Before I could introduce you to Mr. Duckington, the round started. At least I got murdered. <laughs> um, what is this rat doing? Very demure, very mindful. That's the me so. She needs help. Um, excuse me, what the actual f- I am so talented! Are you kidding me? Wait, oh my literal god! Guys, a bacon has uh. approached me. It seems that I made him upset. Bro is acting like I stole his candy. I had to share my ice cream to calm this bacon. But he ran. I told him to have ice cream. He said why? I replied with yes. As I was documenting the bacon, I came across Emily chasing Sergwick mistaking him for her husband. In the process, I nearly lost my foot. I went through the vents and made my way to the stairs. And a brave Bonita saved the day. Just then, I came across King Julian. Do you like to move it, move it? Maurice, where are you? Huh? There is a pale-looking creature staring at me. Ew. Shut up, King of the Guinea Pigs. Somebody help. It's attacking me with a beach ball. Um. Oh my god, there is a Fossa attacking help. Oh my god, Emily. Have you seen Victor? He must be with Victoria. What? But we're supposed to get married today. Oh, congratulations. How are you supposed to congratulate me when he's with Victoria? Oh, maybe the two of them are meant to be. Look, there's Victor. You're right, Pale Orc. I bless their marriage as I end my days of being the corpse bride. Truly amazing on your behalf, Emily. You poor thing, let me bless you too. Wait, Emily, I have gotten your blessings already. Pixel can be referred to as the Pale Orc from now on, law. Don't you think she resembles a rat? I mean, just look at her, squeaking to herself when there's a battle behind her. True indeed. You refer to her as Rat, and I'll refer to her as the Pale Orc or Pixel Law. The others can decide what to call her. Hey, stop bullying me and go away, stupid voices. It seems Rat has found Emily with a fairy wand. She must want one now. Didn't she have one before? She did. She lost it during the battle. Battle, you say? Yes, the battle of the five armies. You're telling me this rat fought in such a terrific battle. Of course, that's one of many things that makes our Pixelin special. Yet I love to bully her. Wow, do you think she will abandon us if we keep this up? No, she has a soft heart. She would never be our family. Why does this girl pause every time and says something? I think she hit her head too hard on a rock that one time. Oh, when we went exploring Mirkwood with Pen and Pearl. That's right. Wait, the people don't know about Pearl. Now they know her. Roll the next clip. Guys, look. It's the king of guinea pigs. I must maintain my distance. I heard them talk about Juan Lore. Enough yapping, Maurice. Fetch me Brown Julian now. I can't run my kingdom with a dry brain. You must be quiet, sir. Someone might hear us. That someone is me. Evacuate. We must evacuate. You good for nothing, Maurice. Your king comes before yourself. So use your legs and kindly run, please. Don't mind me, guys. I'm just a videographer. Oh my god, it's the pale creature. Hi, King Julian. Just do your thing. I won't be a bother. I found an alternative drink, sir. They call it chocolate milk. Don't leave me here standing, Maurice. Bring me a chair to sit on and get some information about this pointy-eared creature who calls herself a videographer. Maurice. Heard, sir. Heard. This drink is good. I'm off to the jungle. I don't like this place. It's boring. But so wait. Oh, he's gone. I teleported to another dimension and found new people to document. 
Oh my god, guys, I found another me in this dimension. Twin. Where have you been? Look who decided to show up. I will never forget the trauma this map gave me. Oh my god! After ages, we stumbled across a rare species. Lo and behold, new friends. This is a wild blondie knot. Oh, uh, it seems Pixel has made a run for it. All this girl does is run away from her problems. You have your wand. Be brave, Pixel. Easier said than done. Oh! You nearly got me killed. You should have used your wand. As I said, easier said than done. Let me teleport. Oh my god, Blondina. If only you were quicker, Pix. You've made the Blondinas extinct. Oh, shut it. Let's have a moment for this Blondina. The moment my eyes met yours. I just knew you were special. That's enough. Go save the day. Why don't you do it? Because I'm small and frail. I thought so. Let the bigger person do the work. You mean elder. I hate you both. I endured blistering wines and scorching desserts. I climbed the highest place. Oh my god. Cat got your tongue pixelin. Go on about your journey. Oh, just you wait. Let me finish her sentence. Our rat endured blistering wines and scorching desserts. She climbed the highest places to save our butts. We are breathing today all thanks to Pixel. I should have left you both with the orcs. Now let me handle this round in peace. Someone took the gun. You're joking. Thankfully, a blonde blonde saved the day. This requires no context. No, it does. Let our friends watch Pix's shenanigans for five seconds. Don't you see? See what? That another pixie of another dimension has no one. What? She is missing a cute frog, a motionless butterfly, a yapping bunny, and a fairy, and a soundless bat. Um. Theoretically speaking. We were never family. What if that is her younger self? She is supposed to have Harold. Oh, that's right. But where is he? Um. Um. That's not our pixel, haha. -ha. Yep. That imposter is missing pointy ears and long white blonde locks that sway majestically in the wind. Wait, is that who I think it is? Are we thinking the same thing? We thought too much. Isn't that her long distant cousin Fiona in her human form? It is. We must have confused our friends, whoops. You're the one who brought it up. In case anyone doesn't know, Fiona is the pale Urk's long distant cousin from Greenwood. The ones who watch the never ending saga video will know. Wait, so if Fiona can turn into an orc, does that mean Pix's current form is an orc? Or is she a pixie and her name is not Pixie? Oh my god, her name is not Pixie, so that means. Stop overthinking me. So much lore. Now that you mentioned it, is Pixel a pixie or an orc? Or is she an elf? Stop getting into conclusions. I am pixie, and pixie means me. Yes, a disappointment indeed. Shut up, Patch, or I will leave you in the deepest, darkest parts of Merkwood. I am so scared, OMG. My sixth sense is kicking in. What do you mean? Huh? Oh! That's what I meant. You could have said it sooner. Um, Orklin is going through an aftershock. I'm okay. I'm fine. Kinchana. Kinchana. Ding, 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 ding. Kumanahan rasa sakit. Oh! This is so pixel coated lol. Oh, shut up. She got flung like this once, did she not? In your dreams, I did. She probably deleted the footage. I always add my embarrassing or funny moments. Like right now. Wow. I endured glistering wines and scorching desserts. I climbed the highest places. Wait a minute. Hold on. Is he Hildegard's grandson? Why bro built like that? What do you mean, Pix? You both look the same. Cat got your tongue again. Finish your lines. Let me do the honor. Our rat endured blistering winds and scorching deserts. She climbed the highest places on Earth just to save us. Let's drop a flower to appreciate our orc's efforts. Enough of their nonsense. Let's get to the real deal now. <laughs> Come
Come on, Pixel, go win. I'm getting the tingles. What? Nothing. Well, let hold one. Few players called him out for camping, and he told the server to shut up. You know what I did? Yes, I did that. The sheriff immediately saw me. I had the footsteps power equipped, and it made me lag. So I let the sheriff win. But we had some difficulties. Here is a sheriff montage of Miss Evangeline. She finally got me. See guys, growth is a process of trial and error. Why is Pixel zooming in on us? There she goes yapping things we can't comprehend. That is because you don't have comprehending skills. Now watch me and my epic sheriff skills. The two of you could never ha ha. Look, I can do that with my eyes closed. For real. For someone who is smaller than the gun, don't talk big. Another day, another moment to show off my epic skills. Also guys, look, aren't these jellyfishes cute? By the time this video gets uploaded, I'm pretty sure most of you have finished the event. As for me, I am on the last tier and I have four more weapons to unbox. I will get the Waves knife real soon. Please look forward to me showing it. It seems that the Murd got everyone as Orclin was making herself comfortable in the sewers. As she should in her natural habitat law. OMG look at her. Freaking Bear Grylls cameraman wannabe. She is documenting everyone. Let a girl live and record funny MM to dead poses. Who is feeding you all? That's right shush. And that's how you do it. Um, what's up? Guys, if I ever go missing in MM2, make sure you check a trail of sandcastles, because I will be the one who leaves it behind. And you will easily find me. Instead of reading your children the story of Hansel and Gretel, read them Pixie and her sand castle. Long ago in the ancient days, there dwelled a creature. Pixie, they called her. She skipped through her path swaying her long blonde white locks with a big grin on her face. She always carried a bucket of sand. You may wonder why she needed a whole bucket of sand. That is because she wanted people to find her through the sand castles she built in case she got lost. It could also be used as a form of distraction for the wild creatures, as they waited to be rescued by a brave warrior. Totally works. Oh my god, you won't believe this. I found Penn's daughter. Isn't she just like him? Are you sure that's his daughter? Whoa, she doesn't take after. Shush. Lee. My bad guys. Look at her hide in the cabinet. Like father, like daughter. Nice attempt, niece. You will get to Aunt Pixie's level in no time. That would be a degrading factor. Thank God she is not related to you. Wow. Good game, niece. Let's drop a chocolate in the comments for Little Pen. This is a sight I dreaded to see. Little Pen camping. Pen, what have you taught her? She tried to attack me. Watch how I end her. <laughs> um, excuse me, what the actual f- Pen, where are you? Have mercy and pet. Have mercy. No mercy for you, young one. <laughs> Guys, meet my friend Barry. 
I'm standing next to him so he can bring me luck and help me get the wave's knife. Wow, the game just teased me. Thanks for the help, Barry. Making my way downtown to meet my baby niece. Peek a boo. Air grow up. Wow. Can you let me focus? You do you, Coco. Bunch of old hacks disturbing my peace. Come, Coco. I will act as a bait. Oh, thanks, Pixel. Mayday, mayday. Get back. I will save us. You got this. Oh my god, I have trapped my niece. Don't worry, I got this. Yes, you got this. Get a good shot of me winning. I'm on it, don't you worry. <laughs> it's okay, Coco. We tried. You're a noob. Wow. At least you are a friend. I feel honored. Now give me Robux. Sorry, niece. Your anti-pix is quite broke. Little Pen was consistent on asking me if I had Robux. I said no and both of us got got. Then I asked her about Pen's well-being. She asked me what Pen. Is she not Pen's daughter? Have I met the wrong niece? I had such good murd moments and at the end I realized I wasn't recording. Also, Coco told me she was joking about not knowing Pen. Or was she lying? Then this girl asked me to give her a knife. I replied with the classic I am broke comment and the bacon got us. I was just kidding. I gave her a starfish knife. Before I could know whether she liked it, I got disconnected. I haven't played with her ever since. <laughs> 